Alright, hi again everyone, back today again for more Pokemon Yellow. And last time we just kind of cleared up the Snorlax blocking the way. And I think this time we're going to have a fight with some of the trainers we missed out on. I'm not sure when you're supposed to fight these people, so this could be... Like really under leveled, or it could be just perfect, we'll see in the first fight. Yeah, I guess I should have done this way earlier. Oh well, at least it'll be quick. And just remember to actually have a timer ready, so I can have a clue what I'm doing. Oh, leveling up is a good start. But since he already did just level up, I think we should take out the closest one to leveling or to evolving. I still think I'll get rid of the dog trio just because, I don't know, I want something left in my party that can actually evolve. Instead of just being full of already fully evolved Pokemon halfway through the game. Doesn't sound like a lot of fun. Oh. Oh yeah, I finally got a hidden item and it turns out to be an escape roll. Yeah, I don't think there's anything interesting to catch around here, so I'll just go for the trainers. And then after that we'll, I guess we'll head on to, down to Fuchsia City. It's on the route down there. And I, yeah, next time I Charmeleon evolve or levels up, I'll probably use the rare candy on him. So I'm pretty sure I saved it. I don't think I used it on anyone. Yeah, I should have fought all of these people before Lieutenant Surge. Probably would have helped a lot. Instead of just fighting Diglets off screen. Yeah, I'll use the rare candy on him now to just make things a bit faster. So I might as well switch him out since I'll be using it. Oh yeah, I still didn't check on Nidorino to see if I can teach him Horn Drill. Or to see if I should. Yeah, and I'm actually recording this on a Sunday. It's weird for me to record a day before I release it, but... I don't know, I just felt like planning ahead a tiny bit. Yeah, of course I would. Oh, I forgot about the rare candy. Oh, did I catch a Pidgey? Just to get my catch count up, I think if this doesn't kill him, I'll catch just to be a bit closer to my item finder and of course, oh, the one time I don't want a critical hit. Alright, so, do I have the rare candy? I do. And I'll switch him out to the top of the party. And find a trainer. And is there anything down here? No, I guess not. Yeah, I don't know if everyone heard the bad news about E3 being cancelled this year. It's a real shame, I was looking forward to it a lot. Some of my favourite videos to make is just kind of recaps and little reviews and all that of gaming showcases. But hopefully something good will happen around that time. It's a lot of games I was hoping they'd show off around that time, but... If it's not going to be at E3, hopefully it'll still be around the same time. Hopefully something to make up for it. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's before... Fire attacks will be really strong against a Magnemite. 
Oh, is this our first Magneton? I think it is. It's just three Magnemites stuck together. Yeah, it's going to be a pretty easy fight even still. Unless he paralyzes me, that'd be an annoying end. But no, we're good. I'll probably level up pretty fast because I'm getting a lot of experience. I'm trying to make sure now not to miss any. I think there's only two or three more, so. I'm not sure if we're supposed to find anything here or if it's just trainers. Like if there's a reason to come back to Vermilion now. Did I miss something or is it just to open up the world a bit more? Yeah, I, I, I'm going to check now. I don't know. Part of me wants to know, part of me just wants to leave it a little mystery. And I suppose he's just love heart. Yeah, I got everyone here. Got another engineer. Oh, he's never won. It's kind of sad. Let's see if we can figure out why. Oh, it's actually not a terrible Pokemon to start with. But I did just realize I've never used Slash. Will the first time be a critical? It was. Yeah, I was saying it has a higher critical hit ratio, I think. Oh, I think that's the first ball picks we saw. Oh, good. Great battle. Two hits. Nah, I doubt she'll level up yet. And that might be almost it. I think there's one down here. Yeah. I think it's just him and the guy just above us and then that'll be it. I wonder how many Pokemon I've seen so far. I'll have to check that out because I've surely has to be at least up to 50 by now. And will that finish him off with the extra attack? Nice. Oh, I thought I leveled up there for a second. Yeah, this should be a really quick battle. Will it finally evolve after this battle? It could happen. Like, these have given me a lot of experience so far. Oh, ah. It'll definitely be soon, I know that much. And, oh, get him. Oh, jeez, this is a big area. They must have spent, like, I don't know how you're supposed to beat this place before fighting or even after fighting Lieutenant Surge. Kind of a weird little area. Oh, good. Grass type. Easy one hit kill. Especially 17 levels ahead. Feels good to just destroy an Oddish. Surely this will be it. Oh, here we go. Right at the end of the battle too. Perfect timing. And of course, one of the most famous Pokemon of all time probably coming up. One of the most well-known. Does he look... Oh, yeah, he looks pretty good in this. Finally have a Charizard. 
And while we're here, might as well check the Pokedex entry for him. How many have we seen? 81. Jesus, that's more than half. Is he... Oh my god, how many are here? I, I don't want to leave just one or two, but... Oh my god, I didn't expect this many. But at least we get to test out the Charizard. Hopefully he looks as good from behind. Okay, he looks a bit... Sick, but I suppose he's okay. Yeah, I suppose he's... Yeah, if I keep my party the way it is, everything has evolved. It's going to be a very boring last four badges. I haven't even thought about HMs yet. But, you know, like I say, cross that bridge when we get to it. And hopefully that's the last one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's just one more under him, because I can actually see the edge of Vermilion now, so... Oh yeah, and there's one quick thing we have to do after this battle. Which hopefully only has one Pokemon. Oh good. It's a nice little break. And is that it? See the last one? Actually, I wonder if he's a gambler. Oh, I wasn't expecting a polywag. Really wasn't expecting a hypnosis. Hopefully he won't keep trying to use rage while he's asleep and just not letting me switch out. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. That could have ended really badly if he didn't wake up really fast. And I suppose I, no, I'll keep up with the rage. It'll probably be a one-hit kill. Ah, oh, really close. Oh, oh, I thought I missed for a second. And finally finished off this area. Oh, honestly, I'm glad I didn't do it back when I was in Vermilion because that would have taken forever. And yeah, while we're here, HM2 is fly. And we can teach that to our Charizard. And I'll probably get rid of... Do I still have Leer? Yeah. I never use it anyway, so might as well. And now we can finally get out of here faster. Is there anywhere else I can pick up anything while I'm here? I don't think I missed anything, so... No, now that I think about it, it's probably faster to just cycle back. But I will use a repel so I don't get into any annoying battles. Because the trainers here were worth it, kind of, but wild battles really wouldn't be. And, you know, I think I'll just pick up the good rod while... Oh, yeah, actually, before I do... Yeah, 22... And I'm pretty sure if I go down here. Oh, one. One last battle before I get my good rod.
Yeah, I think I'm going to get the good rod. Like, have a few looks around just to see if there's anywhere I can get anything good. And I think that'll be enough. It's going to be weird to have this episode ready before I need to, not just panic and do it for in the like last hour, but it'll be nice to do. And just in case he explodes, I'm going to get rid of my weak Pokemon. <laughs> wow, love that big smile. You can barely tell there's a smile in these graphics, but I'm 90% sure that's what it's supposed to be. Oh, if he used Explosion at this point. Am I safe? Yeah, I think I'm okay. I'm going to try Poison Sting. Just okay, I knew it would happen. Of course, it would be a critical hit. But, at least the battle's over. And I, I actually, I have a... Oh, what am I saying? I have Fly now. Doesn't matter if I have Revive or not. Finally. Oh! Okay. I guess I skipped a rod. We're not we're getting the good rod for hours and I guess I <laughs> I have no idea where you get it at this point. Ah, oh, I was gonna switch it, but I'll do it next time. Hopefully it'll be something good. I might replace my dog trio with whatever this is. Okay, I won't, but if I can catch it, I'll take it. I'm just hoping I can burn him now, because that would be a perfect way to end this. Nah, I didn't think so. And how much damage does he do? Yeah, well, I'll take a chance. I caught the... Snorlax easier than I expected, but no, I wasn't that lucky here. I'll go again. Not the same. Suppose I'll take a chance with my Paris. I doubt he'll be killed in one hit, so I should be okay. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention at the start, the OBS sound thing is going weird, so if there's anything wrong, hopefully it'll be fine, but if there's anything wrong, I don't even know what to say. Like I was saying before, it just kind of changes whatever it wants, when it wants sometimes. Wow. Like, I'm glad I have a lot of Pokeballs, because... I'm nowhere close to catching him. Didn't mean to do that. No, I'm going to try a great ball because this is going nowhere close. Hopefully it'll at least get closer. Wow. Okay, that's good. Critical hit. Because I think one more bubble will kill me. No, it won't. And that's 23 Pokemon. Yeah, I was kind of banking on the good rod to get like a tentacle or something like that.
or even maybe oh no you can't get goldeen or anything like that can you Yeah, I'm just going to have a quick uh, three or four to see who comes up. Hopefully something nice to raise will come out because I want something new to evolve. Fuck's sake. I don't even know if I have one, but... No, I'm just going to run from that one. At least I know it's here and it'll be a lot easier to catch than the Seedra. Not even a nibble. The amount of times I've seen that pop up over my life when I was trying to search for certain things. If anyone's familiar with Phoebus in uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Yeah, this isn't looking like a very uh, varied area. Oh, what? oh no. I mean, if Paris dies, I'll just one shot it with my Pikachu, but. Okay. I'm gonna try one more place before I finish off. Yeah, just the place I tried the old rod earlier on. I, I really miss having registered items where you can just press select to use it. Because hopefully there'll be something different here. Ooh, definitely. Definitely getting that. That can be my replacement for Dog Trio. Or can it at level 5. Yeah, I'm going to look up where to get the EXP share and hopefully it's soon but I'm happy with that Poliwag was I thought I couldn't catch it so it might have told me I can't get a Poliwag because I didn't have the super rod so it was impossible for me to get it that time Oh, back in the worst area. I hate the look of it so much. It's just too blue. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to have one quick fish search up here because if there's anywhere I expect to catch like a goldine or something, it'll be around here. So after one or two checks here, I'll finish up for today. It's a nice chill episode. Nothing too intense going on. No gym leaders or graveyards or anything. Oh, come on. I still can't believe I missed the... How did I miss the good rod? Like, I've... I don't think there's a house I missed. Unless they expect you to go up that way after you go to Fuchsia or something. I really don't know. Wow, it's like this just does, doesn't want me to stop. Oh, there we go. And then I'll have a quick cycle over to Bill's house and check under there. Oh, nice. Do I want to use my Goldeen or a Poliwag later on? That's a tough one. I wasn't expecting to be level 30. Yeah, since all my Pokemon are nearly dead, I'll just... I'll try not to kill it, but if I do, I do. I think I'll be happier with the Poliwag. But at this point, any Pokemon I can get, just to put up my little catch number. Okay, that was a lot easier than I expected. Not, I will still quick uh, have a quick cycle over to Bill. Just in the off chance there's something different over there I'm not to lose. 
Oh, I forgot about that. You know, we'll do it on the right side. The further away, the better. Possibly. <sighs> well, fishing on a bike is always the best activity. Which is not being nice to me today. Oh, come on. Oh, I'm going to try five more times if it doesn't get anything, and then I'm done. <laughs> it hurt me. Oh, God, this is hard to decide. Krabby's one of my favorite Pokemon. Good, I, I was planning to get rid of that. I'm glad I didn't do it yet. Oh, then again, it's level 10. Yeah, this is going to be a really hard decision. Krabby or Poliwag? This is part of the time I wish I had viewers. I could just put up a poll or something. Ah, oh, well... I, I guess come back next time to decide if I picked a Krabby or a... Poliwag. But yeah, next time I'll get back to the main game, head down to Fusia with whichever Pokemon I pick. So yeah, thanks for watching and see you again next time.